Here is what's inside the Nautilus Prime X limited edition box. On the left hand side here is the Nautilus Prime X battery. And here we have the Nautilus Prime X port for the Nautilus coils. And here we have the Nautilus Prime X port for the BP coils. And here the big guy here is the Nautilus Prime X RDTA. And here is the Nautilus Prime X 510 adapter. On the right hand side here we have six different coil setups. So from the top row, we have the Nautilus PVC coil 1.6 ohm and the Nautilus PVC coil 1.8 ohm and the popular Nautilus 2S mesh coil 0 0.7 ohm. And here we have four BP coils that includes 1.0 ohm BP, 1.6 ohm, 1.17 ohm and 1.3 ohm BP mesh coils. So here we have the BP RBA which is compatible with the Nautilus Prime X BP part and here we have the Nautilus Prime RBA which is compatible with the Nautilus Prime X part for the Nautilus coils. And here is a little gadget box. Let me show you what's inside. So inside the gadget box here we have a type C charging cable. And inside of this little plastic bags, we have three sets of screws for the Nautilus Prime RDTA, the BP RBA, and also the Nautilus Prime RBA. We also include a three-way Allen key, a 510 drip tip adapter for the RDTA, also a 510 connector for the BP RBA. So inside the box here, we have a little postcard. Behind the postcard, we have the operation manual. Now let's see what device looks like with all different parts set up on. And here is the Nautilus Prime part for the Prime. And here is the Nautilus Prime part for the Nautilus coils. And here is the Nautilus Prime X part for the BP coils. And here is the 510 adapter with our Nautilus GT. With the 510 adapter, you can use any tanks with 510 threads. And here is the RDTA. So to change the airflow, just simply turn the airflow ring from left to right or from right to left. The ring can be adjusted in 360 degrees. And now we're gonna try to build this RDTA.
inside the chamber you see a little triangle shaped bump and here on the build deck you will see a triangle shaped stair. So align these two parts before you close the chamber onto the build deck. So basically just like that. See? All closed off. So inside the accessory bag there's a 5 temp drip tip adapter. So with the 5 temp drip tip adapter you can simply take out the 8 temp drip tip and fit the 5 temp drip tip adapter on top. Then fit in any 5 temp drip tip you have in hand. 